Have you ever wondered how much would it cost if you lit your entire house with nightlight? Of course you haven't. Why would you even think that? But I'm here to tell you anyway. Now I'm not saying that you unscrew all the light bulbs in your house and you only have night lights. What I am suggesting is that you have a night light in every room in the house, in every hallway, every kitchen, every bathroom, whatever. So psh, turn off all the lights, it's dark, it's the middle of winter. You can walk around the entire house and still see where you're going just using night lights. Let's find out. So first, a little background into this question. A few years ago, I got this night light. Mm, it's okay, not that great. And then I upgraded to this, ooh, it's got a slider so you can make it brighter or dimmer. And then just a few weeks ago, in anticipation of making this video, I was checking out night lights on Amazon and I came across this six pack. And these are really small. They're actually the brightest ones I have. These are really cool. So I have a few smart sockets and I decided that I would plug some night lights on smart sockets, put it in a dark place, turn it on, and I left it on for about three months straight just so I could find out how much this is costing me in electricity. So today I'm going to answer the question, how much would it cost in electricity and how much does it actually cost to buy all of the night lights? So now I'm going to move you to a spreadsheet that I put together and let's find out. All right, let's have a look. As you can see here, I've got August, September, October, three months of data. They should be all relatively the same since a month is about the same. Uh, they are not. So I'm gonna go ahead and just talk about the data from October since that's the highest one. Let's go ahead and just get the data from the highest one. To explain the spreadsheet a bit, I have the price per kilowatt hour. This is the low my electric company charges me and this is the high, so it's either about nine cents a kilowatt hour or 10 cents a kilowatt hour. Here you can see for the total month of October, I use 0.18 kilowatt hour. Wow. So. Basically, you can see for the entire month of October, it cost me about two to two cents a month. For the entire year, it's about 20 cents to go ahead and use that nightlight on 24 seven. And if you're using the highest calculation, we're talking about 23 cents. So in this part of the spreadsheet, I calculated different home scenarios. I priced out how much a nightlight cost per unit and multiplied it by the number of outlets that we're gonna put in the home, and then I calculated the electricity prices a well according to the electricity from my electric company. So let's have a look. If we're looking at a fairly modest home, we'll say three bedrooms, one bathroom, one kitchen, one living room, hallway, and in the parentheses, I have how many night lights we're putting in each room. So three in each bedroom, two in each bathroom, three in the kitchen, four in the living room, seven in the hallways, you can see the total number of outlets is 25. That cost me $41.50 just to buy the night lights, but in electric prices for the year, we're talking about four to $6 is all. You can see these prices obviously increase as the home gets big, but let's go ahead and talk about my home, which has 60 bedrooms, 20 bathrooms, nine kitchens, 40 living and family rooms, a uh, huge hallway and a garage shop. This is for reals my home, for reals. I'm kind of a rich guy and have this huge mansion. So if we look at how many outlets all together, this is 512 outlets. So buying the actual night lights costs about $850, but the electricity prices per year and keep in mind, this is running them 24 seven. It's about $100 to 120. Doesn't cost much in electric prices to have 512 night lights in my mansion. That's pretty cool. So I know this data doesn't really mean much and probably no one's gonna watch this video, but this was interesting to me just cause I like knowing how much things cost to run in electricity. And to be quite honest, uh, I was kind of impressed that these things cost hardly anything to run if you just leave them on all the time. So I've started actually buying a bunch of these. Like I mentioned, I got a couple packs on Amazon, a couple six packs for like $10. So it's less than $2 each nightlight. I put them everywhere in the home. 
And it's really nice because I don't have to turn on lights going down hallways or something at night. If you're the kind of person like me who turns on a light to see where you're going and then you forget to turn off the light, you could actually end up saving a lot of money just by never having to do that again. The only issue I have with this is my children love to pull out night lights. So that's great. Just plug them in all the time. So now you know something you never knew you wanted to know. Maybe. I'll post some links below to some of the night lights that I've tried out that I think are cool if you want to try them out for yourself and just put them all in your house. I mean, why not? It's super cheap.